All right. Now we're doing Freight Code Camp, JavaScript Algorithms and Data Structures Beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role-playing game. Step 164. All right. So inside our while loop, we're going to push a random number between 0 and 10 to the end of the numbers array. We can create this random number with math.floor and then, pardon me, with a math.random times 11 and then doing a math.floor on that, right? So it's 11 because zero is included. So uh, zero and then one through 10 is 11 numbers, right? So what we're going to do here is I forgot, I was looking at this in a, a rehearsal and I forgot if we actually went through push or not. And even if we did, let's, uh, let's, let's go over it again, right? So if you push... If you push, if you put push method JavaScript into your Google search, uh, MDM web, web docs will come up first. We just click this and the push method of array instances adds a, pardon me, adds the specified elements to the end of an array and returns the new length of the array, all right? So if we got this thing, we've got animals, pigs, goats, and sheep right there. Uh, we'd say, let's forget about the counts. Let's uh, do console.log animals. When we do uh, animals.push, we'll get pigs, goats, sheep, and cows. Let's uh, prove that. So we've got that right there. And then when we push chicken, cats, and dogs, all separated by commas, you'll see that chickens, cats, and dogs is added to the array that we made uh, right here, right? So that's how push works. So let's come down here and do that. So we'll say inside this while loop, uh, numbers dot push, and we will push uh, a math dot random. So math dot random times eleven. Whoops, times eleven. Right. Then we'll wrap this math dot random times eleven in parentheses, and we'll do a math dot floor on it. Math dot floor like that. All right. So let's cap it off with a semicolon. And for this one, let's come down here and do a console.log. No, 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 no. Let's do outside of this. Let's do a console.log numbers, all right? And then let's let's uh, run the pick eight since it does have pick in it already, all right? And so let's say pick eight like that. And let's come over here to the console and you see it does uh, do some random numbers, 11 random numbers. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 19. It does 10 random numbers because numbers.link needs to be less than 10 uh, inside of this thing, all right? Is that how it's supposed to go? While numbers.link is less than 10, do that. Okay, so zero and then one. So zero, it does this one, two, three, four, five. Oh, and then once it gets to 10, it doesn't do it again. Okay, cool. Anyway, so let's check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 165 and we'll see you next time.